ओके गाइस लेट्स स्टार्ट सो आई एम बैक वेलकम टू माई चैनल चेस सेंटर एंड हियर अवी डू डेली पजल्स एंड डेली टैक्टिक ट्रेनिंग एंड एंड गेम पजल्स टू सो दिस इज अ वेरी इजी पजल वन स्टार पजल गाइस इट इज नॉट एट ऑल डिफिकल्ट इट इज वाइट टू प्ले एंड गेन एडवांटेज वाइट टू मूव गाइस यू आर वाइट यू हैव टू मूव अ पीस एंड यू हैव टू गेन एडवांटेज इट इज अ इंटरमीडिएट लेवल प्लेयर गाइस Uh, it is an intermediate level puzzle, guys. So whoever is of advanced player uh, level, just don't guess uh, what type of easy silly puzzles is, is this. Uh, you can check out my advanced levels uh, puzzle sections, and you can uh, train yourself over there. It is a completely free training. So guys, pause the video and start thinking. ओके गाइस सो हियर आई अज्यूम यू हैव ऑलरेडी पॉज द वीडियो एंड नाउ यू आर रेज्यूमिंग द वीडियो टू गेट द आंसर एंड चेक वेदर योर आंसर इज करेक्ट और नॉट सो लेट्स स्टार्ट गाइस सो वी वॉट वी सी यूर यस सी द अगेन आई टोल्ड क्वीन रू कैन द ब्लैक क्वीन दे आर इन द सेम डायग्नल सेम लाइन एंड इफ यू वॉन्ट टू यू शुड ऑलवेज कीप आई ऑन सच थिंग्स सो हियर वी कैन डू अ डिस्कवर्ड अटैक वॉट इज डिस्कवर्ड अटैक वेन वन पीस फ्रॉम बिटवीन जस्ट टू मूव अवे Okay, and for piece which was behind, gives an attack to opponent's piece. It's called as discard attack. And how to use it? It's very simple. Move the piece which is in between and give. Try to give it a check. Try try to use it and give a check. This will force your opponent to kill the piece or move his king anyhow, and you will able to kill the piece opponent's that piece which you wanted. So it was a very easy puzzle. White to play two move puzzle and gain advantage. So now let's move on to our today's second puzzle. So before moving, guys, whoever is whoever hasn't subscribed till subscribe the channel. We do daily training, individual day, every day, guys. Our new videos are uploaded, guys. So like the video, share, subscribe, and make the notification button to all. Okay, so let's start. This is a good puzzle. Another good puzzle too. It is white to play and give your best move. Let's start. Okay, guys. So pause the video. I think so. And I assume you all have already paused the video, and now you are resuming the video to find the answer and check your answer. So let's start. You are white. White to play. White to move. What is the best move for white? Yeah. If your answer is this, it's correct. Sacrifice the king. Sacrificing the queen. Using the queen and killing the rook. Okay. How means there are like many people will see. uh this is a pin over here we should solve it and then try to kill the pawn we should play something like this or uh, taking the queen over here and all but that is not that effective so for now we just ignore that that may be the wrong i just want to say ignore that things what is the best one just concentrate on this and stick to the topic the answer is use the queen to kill the rook okay like this Now what happens? This will force C. If he doesn't kill us back, he is losing the five points. So it, of course, he has to kill. Doesn't kill. We already won. If he kills, which he should, means he has the only option. So he will kill. And now the puzzle is actually on the pass pawn promotion. See what we did do was the queen was blocking the way of pawn. So we just moved the piece. We deflected it. We decoyed it. whatever you say guys we just took our queen over here and forced this queen to come out of the way and now we will not push the pawn it we should also not even there is no need to put this bishop over here the best way is simply just put your rook over here okay and uh, see this is a double attack even if wins whatever he do if he uses his queen to kill our rook we will kill the queen and get a uh, we will kill his queen we will do a profit of 4 points and get our pawn promoted and get a new queen and if he tries to defend it uh, something like this then it is very simple we will take on the queen he will kill it and we will don't 
But hurry guys, we will first put the bishop over here. Let him kill this pawn, it's okay. Even if he kills, with next chance we can promote promote it to the queen and he will kill, we will kill with the bishop. It's easy, we will just take the king out like this, then this, and we will stop his pawn, then possible we will come here, if not then it's okay. And then we will use our bishop like this to kill the pawn with the support of the king from here. Okay, so that's very easy already, go gain the good enough advantage. So I think so guys, we should stop on this puzzle over here. And whoever not subscribed guys, subscribe the channel, like the video guys, uh, push the notification button to all and let's start and let's move on to our third puzzle guys. So okay, what should we do? It, the question is black to play. Puzzle is bit complicated, I may I count it as a two star difficulty puzzle. First two puzzles are one star but this is a two star, you need to think on it guys. Pause the video. Take your time, think 5 to 10 minutes, you will get the answer, I hope. Even if you don't get, I am going to tell the answer. So it's cool. Start thinking guys. Pause the video. Okay guys, so let's go on to the answer. I assume that you all have already paused the video, thought on it, waiting for my answer. And now you have resumed. Even if you didn't thought and you just want to directly move on the answer, save your time, it's okay, no problem. Just make sure guys, if you want to improve the chess, you do the training daily. Daily, just you need to spare 10 minutes anytime. Just download, I every day send a video, just download the video, every day I upload a video. So just download it while traveling in bus, train, anytime having a lunch, dinner, just 10 minutes. Keep the video on. You will utilize your time more beneficially. And let's start. So it's black's chance. What should black play? Many people will say like we should play the knight back. We should move the knight rook away. And many many variations it looks. But there is only one variation that is best. In other all the variation white gets the advantage. Okay. So let's start. Uh, if you take the knight back no, your rook is going to die. So it's a useless variation. And let's move to some uh, the main variation what blacks needs to play that is using the knight to kill the pawn why it already has three and sorry three and fourth defender four defender and still we are killing over here only after having two attackers why let's see why see it also opens a line of rook two and we get two strong rooks to align the low rooks on this rook attacking over here so let's see how will it work we will first use our knight and kill the pawn this will lead to a check and a knight fork too over here also okay so now as he's in check he cannot kill my rook and give me check so that is a thing very much clear now so what will he do he will kill if he kills with his bishop he the rook, rook is left defenseless and so i will use my rook and kill the Kill his rook. So I gain 5. I get a 5 point over here. And 1 point over here. 6 points. And he just get only 3 point knight. And I get. I gain a make a profit of 3 points. If he uses his knight. Any knight. Uh, this knight is attacking over here. So leave that knight. Let's use this knight. Which is not uh, much active. That will help more for the white. So let's see. If he uses his knight. No. Still it's okay. See, you can kill, many people now think to kill the knight, then he will kill us back, then we will play something like this, first we will, so we, our rook, we will also get rid of the attack which is doing over here, no, that's wrong. If you kill with the bishop, he will simply use this rook and kill you. So all the attack what you are going to do over here will go away, understood? So no, what you need to do is, you still you will kill over here only. Why? Let's see. If you kill, then he will kill you back, that's clear. And you will again use another rook to kill. And what happens, you still lay, end up one point advantage, at an advantage of one point. And that's the best variation. Let's go a few moves back and let's see what's and then what happened and then let's stop the video. Knight cross d4, the best move. Uh, knight 3 cross d4, that is the white's best move. Black should always use the rook to kill. 
not this otherwise you yourself will get trapped so you will kill over here now as you saw there is only one defender to this rook and this and this rook behind both the rook are attackers they are attacking the rook so more attackers than attacker will win so that's the rule we will kill we will kill what did we got we got a pawn we got a knight which was here and we got his rook which was here so overall we got 3 plus 5 plus 1 that is 9 points and what did he got he just got one knight which was here and one, one rook which was here understood so we can gain an advantage of 1 point over here okay guys so wait for my next video and advanced level videos are made completely separately with a 3 4 and 5 star difficulty puzzles so hope so you guys enjoyed like share subscribe make the notification button push it to all and bye bye guys wait for my next video tomorrow bye guys